Hi, everybody. Welcome to a student life highlight. Today, we're going to highlight a program that our office sponsors that we're recruiting students for that we think you might be interested in. Today, we're going to talk about the LEAP program, L-E-A-P. LEAP is an 11-week program where students get to learn about the social change model of leadership. Think of it as a fun class with no homework. It's not on your transcript, but it's an 11-week experience that we provide to students who register by September 7th. Class starts on September 14th, and we meet every Tuesday afternoon from 3.30 to 5. Awesome way to make friends and to learn more about yourself. This program is about the social change model of leadership, which has us learn about ourselves as leaders, how to work well with others, and then how do we be good citizens and try to solve societal problems? How do we tackle leadership challenges so that we can do good things out in society? Um, with me today is Oscar. Oscar is one of the many students who's um, participated in this program. And so I wanted to bring him on today just to get to know him a little bit and find out why did he do this program? So Oscar, why don't you introduce yourself? Hello, everyone. As Tirza said, my name is Oscar, and I am a senior uh, majoring in business management as well as entrepreneurship. And I am also a student involvement ambassador for the Office of Student Life and Campus Community, in addition of serving in Student Government Association as student council for the business school. So if you have any questions towards campus happenings, please let me know. But thank you, Tirza. You're welcome. Well, let's jump into it. I've got a couple questions for you. Um, first one is a basic one. Why did you sign up for the LEAP program? Um, I, I signed up uh, again, like uh, I saw a flyer and the flyer really caught my attention because I've been really trying to develop more of my leadership skills. As I mentioned, I am in contact with students a lot and I definitely wanted to be a resource and and again I just wanted to be the best student leader I could. So when you think about like yourself and what you learned what was kind of what did you learn about yourself in this program? I learned how important self-awareness is. I definitely think that you know being aware of your surroundings your environment and just being aware of uh students or people may be going, uh, especially when you're in a, a leadership position, you have to read the room to, to truly uh, maximize, you know, the productivity or again, like being uh, an empath leader, which again, you're able to recognize and, and have empathy towards the people you're leading. Mm -hmm. So one of the things you mentioned was that self-awareness, which in the social change model of leadership is called consciousness of self. Um, some of the things you'll get to do if you participate in this program, if you're watching this video, is you'll get to learn about your leadership style, your conflict management style, what motivates you, how do your values inform the decisions you make as a leader. So when you think about like the biggest leadership lesson you learned from the program, what, what was that lesson? Um, I, my biggest lesson was that there is multiple components of leadership. It's not just one straightforward thing that you need to know, but, and again, that's the beautiful, beautiful thing about developing into a leader. And I think the biggest lesson that I learned was that anyone can be a leader, but it takes, again, the effort to recognize all those different components, like, again, being able to have empathy, being able to have self-awareness, and they're all connected. So, I, yeah, my biggest lesson is that anyone has the potential to be a leader. It's just about discovering each of those components and going into detail. Thank you. Yep, very good. What's one thing you've used from this program, either at work or in student government or maybe in a club? Uh, like I mentioned, I am, you know, talking to students all the time, and I think it taught me to not be in a judgmental stage as far as like, you know, when you come across someone and they might not have the same energy as you, like recognizing that it's not like not taking it personal and really, again, having that self-awareness and, and instead of, again, jumping to conclusions, really, okay, like this student doesn't have the energy, let me find out or let me just ask the, the appropriate questions to actually be any resource to them. And I think I, I've been able to apply that not only to my position here as a student leader, but also, again, with my family, uh, with my friends, any anything within my environment, I've learned to use, again, that understanding piece and not taking too many things personal and just, again, understanding that 
a person, anyone in your life might be going through some that again, like uh, the actually leap uh, Tirza talks about, you know, we all carry, carry this baggage with us that's invisible. And I think that really, at the end of the program, I was really to understand that concept. Yeah, when you come into a group setting, so let's say you come to a club meeting, um, everybody in that room is a leader, whether or not you have a title of like president or vice president or whatever it is, everybody's a leader in the room. We all carry stuff with us, you're right. So you might be having a bad day and you're trying to lead a meeting and it doesn't go well. And it doesn't mean that you did poorly, but it may mean that that person was carrying some stuff with them. Then again, it could also mean that you could improve your skills on leading a meeting and facilitating and public speaking. So yeah, there's lots of leadership skills to learn and they are all integrated. Exactly. So my last question for you is why would you recommend students take the LEAP program? Um, I would recommend it not besides it's a great resume builder, but also, again, you just learn a lot of things about yourself. And I think, I, you know, I wish I would have taken this when I was uh, like earlier in my college career. So I recommend any first year students, second year students, any any year as soon as possible to to really, again, go on the journey of finding, you know, your purpose. And, and again, like, it, it's just about being curious and really uh, exploring what you like, what you don't like. And I think the LEAP program, again, like not, it obviously focuses on leadership, but it also focused on other parts of your life that could really benefit you. And, and again, you don't have to, you know, take the course or be in the program just because you want to be a leader, but just to simply learn more about who you are. Thank you. I appreciate that. So thanks for watching this video. Just to give you some quick information as we wrap up, the LEAP program is again 11 weeks. We start on Tuesday, September 14th. The deadline to apply is Tuesday, September 7th. That gives me a week to get all our materials together for class. Um, but we meet on every Tuesday from the 14th of September through November 30th. And so um, again, I would highly encourage you to do this program if you're free on Tuesdays between 3.30 and 5. Um, you can sign up for this program on my links, mylynx.ucdenver.edu. And once you're in our student engagement platform, you can click on experiences and then you'll see a tile for LEAP. Click on that. You'll find all the information in the application form. Um, so again, Student Life, we love this program. It's one of our favorites because you really do do some deep learning. It's all stuff you can apply to the workplace, to student clubs, to your family. Um, and we hope you'll join us this fall. Thank you, Oscar. Thank you, Taylor.